Hello and welcome back to Learning English Pro. Today we're delving into a transformative period in history, the Reformation. This era, which unfolded from the early 16th to 17th century, reshaped the religious, political and cultural landscape of Europe. The complete word list for all the terms covered in today's video is waiting for you in the video description if you want to follow along. So grab your parchment and quill because we're about to embark on a journey through time. Our story begins in the late Middle Ages, a time when the Catholic Church wielded immense power. This institution was the center of spiritual life in Europe, with the Pope as its figurehead. Enter Martin Luther, a German monk. In 1517, he famously nailed his 95 Theses to the door of the Wittenberg Castle Church. This was a call for reform within the church, highlighting issues like indulgences. Indulgences were a controversial practice within the Catholic Church during the Middle Ages. Essentially, they were certificates issued by the church that claimed to reduce a person's life in purgatory, a place Catholics believed souls went for purification before entering heaven. The problem that figures like Martin Luther had with indulgences stemmed from several key issues. First, many saw them as a form of spiritual bribery, where individuals could essentially buy their way into heaven or absolve their sins with monetary donations. Secondly, the sale of indulgences was often used to fund extravagant projects, including the construction of St. Peter's Basilica in Rome, which raised questions about the church's priorities. Lastly, Martin Luther and other reformers argued that salvation should be based on faith and divine grace, not on financial transactions, leading to one of the central tenets of the Protestant Reformation, justice by faith alone. Luther's actions ignited the Protestant Reformation. It led to the creation of various Protestant denominations, like Lutherism and Calvinism, challenging the Catholic Church's authority. As religious tensions flared, Europe plunged into a series of conflicts. The Thirty Years' War, for instance, devastated parts of Europe and reshaped political alliances. This war was a devastating conflict that raged across Europe from 1618 to 1648. It began as a religious conflict between Catholic and Protestant states within the Holy Roman Empire but eventually evolved into a complex power struggle involving many European nations. The war brought widespread destruction, famine and suffering to the continent, with its impacts felt for generations. It ended the Treaty of Westphalia, which not only marked the conclusion of the war, but also established the principles of state sovereignty and religious tolerance, laying the foundation for modern international relations. In response to the Reformation, the Catholic Church initiated the Counter-Reformation. This movement aimed to reaffirm Catholic doctrine and address internal issues. The Counter-Reformation, also known as the Catholic Reformation, was a vital response by the Catholic Church to the Protestant Reformation of the 16th century. It aimed to address the challenges posed by Protestantism and to revitalize Catholicism. The Council of Trent, a significant event in the Counter-Reformation, clarified Catholic doctrine and practices while addressing some of the criticisms raised by reformers like Martin Luther. The Counter-Reformation also witnessed the founding of new religious orders, such as the Jesuits, dedicated to spreading Catholicism globally. The Counter-Reformation also saw the continuation and intensification of the Inquisition, a system of courts aimed at identifying and suppressing heresy within the Catholic Church. The Spanish Inquisition in particular became infamous for aggressive methods, including torture and public executions, to root out perceived threats to Catholic orthodoxy. While the Inquisition was originally created in the late Middle Ages, its activities gained momentum during the Counter-Reformation as a means to combat the spread of the Protestant religion and maintain religious conformity. While it was controversial and often brutal, the Inquisition was viewed by the Catholic Church as a necessary tool for preserving its authority and the purity of its doctrine during a time of religious and social upheaval. 
Overall, the Counter-Reformation played a crucial role in reshaping the Catholic Church and preserving its influence during a time of religious upheaval. The Reformation also had a huge impact on culture and society. The Renaissance was marked by artistic and intellectual flourishing, driven by new ideas and perspectives. If you'd like to learn more about the Renaissance, I have an entire video dedicated to the subject. The link for that is on screen right now and in the video description below. The legacy of the Reformation lives on to this day. It laid the groundwork for religious diversity, freedom of thought, and the modern concept of individualism. And there you have it, a whirlwind journey through the Age of Reformation. This era of religious upheaval and social change left an indelible mark on history, shaping the world as we know it. Be sure to hit that like button, subscribe and share this video to continue your journey of learning. Until next time, remember, keep learning English like a pro.